Hello everyone, welcome to another Marketing Monday here brought to you by Kid Glove. Uh, Kid Glove, as you know, is a boutique advertising agency with locations in Lincoln and Omaha, Nebraska. And each Monday, one of us brings you some tips on marketing. And we each specialize in different areas. And my area of uh, specialization is community health. So specifically, behavioral health, public health organizations, um, nonprofit, for-profit organizations that are spreading messages of pre prevention, of assistance, of help for a variety of different reasons in the behavioral and public health sector. So that is um, where I spend the majority of my time here at Kid Glove. And my name is Katherine Warren. Today, I wanted to take a moment as we head into the Thanksgiving holiday to think about gratitude in the form of marketing. And what I mean by that is we have something in the marketing field called internal marketing. And it is something very important to the overall success of your organization, whether you're in community health or otherwise. Uh, internal marketing is for your team, your staff, your coworkers as a whole. And um, it's making sure that you're taking time to take care of your most important resource because your most important resource at any organization is your team. So as we move into Thanksgiving, remember to show gratitude and appreciation for your team. And there's a few ways through internal marketing that we can do that the best. The first is number one, always and forever, ask them what they need to feel appreciated. So it's one thing to appreciate your team. It's another thing to ask your team how they feel valued, how they feel recognized the best, and then focus on those means in order to appreciate them. So the best way to find out what your team finds meaningful when it comes to appreciation and recognition, because that can be very, very different depending on your organization, uh, even depending on departments in your organization. So asking them through a simple survey helps you understand how they feel appreciated and valued and what they would appreciate the most. So here at Kid Glove, we use something called a pulse survey that we send out periodically to our team in order to just gauge how are you doing? How are you feeling? Are you happy here at Kid Glove? And how can I recognize you? How can I appreciate you? What is meaningful to you? Some people want a kind note. Some people want some sort of gift or gift card or whatever the case may be. Some people want to gather and celebrate together. But again, you're never going to know this until you ask. And just when you think you might know how your team wants to be valued or appreciated, it might change. So you need to ask and ask again and never assume that you know um, what works best for them or how they feel the most valued. Next, I would encourage you, especially in this community health field, to allow time for self-care and tools and provide tools for self-care. Community health, behavioral health, public health, these are all fields where your team is likely exposed to a lot of trauma. They are exposed to a lot of day-to-day -day stress and challenges and trauma that a lot of us may not even know exist. And so giving your team, especially, the time and the space and the resources they need for self-care is it just must happen, right, in this field. So whether that's allowing time for meditation or yoga or perhaps some of your staff just needs a few hours to reflect and relax and, and, and have some time just to be quiet. Whatever it is, again, ask your team what they need and then allow time for some self-care, especially in this field. Finally, follow up 
and follow through. So one of our favorite things to say in marketing is that it takes seven times, seven touch points for your audience to even start to pay attention to whatever message that you're trying to get out into the world. Your team is no different. So you need to tell them they're appreciated. Then you need to show them. Then you need to ask them how they'd like to be appreciated. And then you need to do it all again and again and again. So again, just when we think that our message or our asking is getting a little bit tired, that's just when our audience is starting to pay attention. No different for our internal audience. So you want to make sure that you're continuing to recognize, to appreciate, and to survey. And that is all I have for you today. So thank you so much for your time and for joining us for these Marketing Mondays. We sure do appreciate doing them and are thankful for all of you. If you'd like to learn more about community health, you can do so on our website at kidglove.com slash community health. Have a wonderful Thanksgiving, and we will talk to you very soon.